This is Carrie Walker with Elsevier Global Medical News reporting from the annual San Antonio Breast Cancer Symposium. Joining me is Dr. Stephen Jones, who presented the first planned results from the team trial, which showed a survival benefit at 2.75 years with adjuvant exemestane over tamoxifen in women with ER-positive breast cancer. This is a very large adjuvant uh, endocrine trial, and this is the first time it's uh, seen the light of uh, day. Uh, it's a little bit uh, complicated. The history goes back to 2001 when we planned uh, this trial. Uh, there are three aromatase inhibitors, uh, Remedex, Vimara, and Aromacin. And we've had reports on the other two uh, aromatase inhibitors, but we've never had an upfront study uh, comparing tamoxifen to exemestane or Aromacin. So this trial got started a little bit later than the other two major uh, studies. Uh, it got started in 2001. And uh, in 2004, we modified this study. And we modified it because we had been involved in another study with exemestane or aromacin, a switching trial, the intergroup exemestane study, where we compared women who were taking standard endocrine tamoxifen for two to three years, uh, followed by aromacin or staying on tamoxifen. And in that study, that switch between tamoxifen and the aromatase inhibitor caused a significant reduction in recurrence rates, reduced second breast cancers, and ultimately actually had a survival benefit. So in 2004, we felt that it was no longer appropriate to just study uh, five years of tamoxifen as the control. We felt that the prior study uh, was not really now tamoxifen being switched to exemestane. So we amended the trial in 2004, and this is the amended trial design. And in order to accomplish these goals, we added additional patients. So we now have accrued 9,775, nearly 10,000 women is a head-to-head -head comparison of tamoxifen to exemestane for slightly under three years. Now, there's no survival difference with that, but there's been no survival difference in any of the upfront aromatase inhibitor trials. What there was is there was an improvement, a reduction in breast cancer events reflected in a, a better disease-free survival, a significant relapse-free survival, and a difference in time to a distant metastasis. So um, do you think that this might translate into better quality of life for these women? The, the safety profile of the aromatase inhibitors and was true in our trial as well. Uh, generally, there were fewer gynecologic uh, complaints. Uh, there was much less chance of a blood clot. Uh, there was no significant cardiac uh, risk compared to uh, tamoxifen. Uh, but you do have some arthralgias, arthritis that comes up with the aromatase inhibitors, and we saw that as well. So far, there was no difference in, in, in rates of fracture, uh, and no difference, uh, and not a significant difference in uterine cancers, although there were a few more uterine cancers with tamoxifen, which is expected in the next This is Carrie Walker with Elsevier Global Medical News in San Antonio.